TPBAFK, The Pirate Bay Away from Keyboard is a documentary film released on 8 February 2013, directed by Simon Kotar, based on the lives of the three founders of the Pirate Bay, Peter Sund, Frederick Henny-I.J. and Gottfried Zwertham. Filming began in summer 2008, and concluded on 25 February 2012. Production The film's website was launched on 28 August 2010, along with a Kickstarter campaign to raise $25,000 to hire an editor after the Court of Appeal trial. The campaign was fully funded within three days and raised $51,424 in total. In February 2011, the Swedish government's Arts Grants Committee Konsnarsnamden granted the project an additional 200,000 Swedish kroner. Release The full film was released under a Creative Commons license onto the Pirate Bay and other BitTorrent sites. Also, a four-minute shorter version was released at the same time for those who wish to remix or re-edit their own version of the film featuring an edit with certain copyright-restricted content removed under a different Creative Commons by NCSAR license. For those who wish to support the creators, apart from online donations, they can buy the DVD version and digital download. The pre-order price of the DVD is $23 and a digital download is $10, which comes with deleted scenes and bonus material. Pre-orders can be made via the official movie website. TPBAFK's premiered at the 63rd Berlin International Film Festival on 8 February 2013, opening the festival's documentary section, and was released online for worldwide free download at exactly the same time on YouTube and on the Pirate Bay. On 19 February 2013, the film was broadcast on BBC4 in the UK as part of the BBC's Storyville documentary series Strand. Reception Peter Sund, one of the main characters in the film, wrote on his blog that he has mixed feelings about the movie and the release of it. While he likes the technical side, he has serious issues with some scenes and general attitude of the film. This includes too much focus put on the trial, too dark depiction of it and portraying himself beyond self-recognition. Despite having such different views on the subject, he regards the director as a friend. Censorship by Hollywood On May 2013, Hollywood studios such as Viacom, Paramount, Fox and Lionsgate started to censor Google search links pointing to the documentary, an action criticized by the director of the film Simon Klosar. On June, after the initial controversy, HBO and Lionsgate sent additional bogus DMCA takedown notices to Google requesting the removal of links related with the TPBAFK. In response, Simon Klosar contacted Chilling Effects which recommended him to file a DMCA counter notice where he explained that the purpose is to share the film as much as possible. Two months later, the censored links were reinstated only after public complaints made by the film director.